Good morning, hot dogs. We're back. Lily, how are you feeling today? A little sick, but that's besides the point. Well, I hope you feel better. Are you Kokomo Doghouse Committee and more after the pledge? Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Staff and students, Veterans Day is on Friday, November 11th, so please take a few moments to honor a veteran. You can do this by going into your email and filling out a form sent out by Mrs. Horrell. This can be any relative or close friend. Make sure to fill out a separate form for each veteran that you'd like to honor. Let's thank those who have served us. IU Kokomo is hosting a free Latino family night at FHS on November 8th. This is going to be an educational event geared towards juniors and seniors of Spanish-speaking families. Learn about IUK's administration process and the benefits of IU degree and make sure to RSVP in the chatter below. And attention sophomores, guidance is taking applications for this year's Hobie Leadership Conference. For more, ask Lexi Faust or junior Eli Grasham. Now we are going to send it off to sports and weather. What's up, dogs? The girls basketball team traveled to Carroll last night for a JV and varsity game against preseason number seven, Carroll. Lady Hot Dogs used a great second quarter with energy and effort on the defensive end with 16 deflections in the first half and four steals as well. With the score being 28 to 14, Carroll ultimately went on a run that ended up being the difference in the game. But the Lady Hot Dogs are looking forward to building off the defensive end and continuing to develop timing on the offensive end. The Lady Hot Dogs were led in scoring by Madison Cook with 12, Soraya Flores, Soraya Flores with seven, and Vanessa Guajardo with five. The JV fell as well and were led in scoring by Vanessa Guajardo with seven. The JV hot dogs are continuing to get better and better. Highlighting the game was the defensive effort creating seven steals in the JV game. The varsity hot dogs are back in action on Saturday here at home in Case Arena against the Fountain Central Mustangs. The game will begin at 7 p.m. varsity only. Come on out and support the Lady Hot Dogs in their home opener. If you can't make it to the game, it will be broadcasted right here on the Hot Dog Network and the IC Sports Network. That's all for sports. Now let's send it to Austin with the weather report. Thanks, Nelson. This morning it was a chilly 47 degrees, and that will be the low for the day, with the high being 71. That's all for weather. Now back to your hosts. Thank you, Austin. The Dog House Committee will be selling holiday hot dog shirts through Monday, November 14. Show your hot dog spirit throughout the holiday season. These would be a perfect holiday gift for any hot dog fan. Short sleeve t-shirts are $12, long sleeve t-shirts are $16, crew neck sweatshirts are $21, and the hooded sweatshirts are $28. These prices are for shirts size youth small through adult extra large. $1 would be added for each additional X larger than extra large. Please note that we are only accepting cash as a payment for this sale. See the flyer for the design and, make, and more information. Make sure to spread the word so we can see these shirts all over Frankfurt. Order forms are available in the office, the bookstore, or the library. A happy birthday goes out to Aiden Burton, Haley Campbell, Lupita Carapria Cartes, Amy Marvio Pozos, and Chloe Smith. For lunch today, lines one and two, country fried steak, lines three and four, natural hot chicken and mac and cheese. Sides are smashed potatoes and green beans. That's all for today, hot dogs. Make sure to like and subscribe. And have a terrific Thursday. See you guys tomorrow.